Looking back on our years together Reminiscing and wondering whether Anything will be different or what we do to fail I'm not saying I was an angel Hello, this is Jake Walls for another YouTube video. If you like this kind of content, movie reviews and everything, movies and music play, and that's your jam, then click that subscribe button and like this video. I'd greatly appreciate it. Today I've got a massive physical media collection update. I've got Blu-rays, CDs, DVDs and books to show you. It's amazing. I really love the stuff I've got. It's amazing. And stuff like that. And stuff like that. So that's sold it off. And I've got some... St now here's a little disclaimer. There's three things I've never sold off in my last physical media collection update. So I apologize on that one. So this is Jake Wells and Nerdwatism, so please let's get into this, shall we? American Underdog on Blu-ray. Here's the back, the front, and of course here's... This was a blind buy, of course, forgot to mention that. And of course, Mockingjay... Part one, Hunger Games. Fantastic. I like these movies, don't get me wrong. So let's throw this one off since it's together. Mark and Jay, part two. 310 to Yuma, brand new factory sealed on Blu-ray. The only really western I dig, to be honest with you. Divergent on Blu-ray. And of course, I've got Bad Moms, which is a really good movie, I thought. Very entertaining film. It's a really great film, I thought. It's very entertaining from start to finish. I really enjoy this movie from start to finish. It's very entertaining. Happy Feet, which is a really good movie. It's Academy Award winner for Best Animated Film, of course. Fantastic movie, I thought. It's very entertaining. Very good animation, too. Pee-wee's Big Adventure. This is the DVD. This is the old Blockbuster release. Can you see that? Is that coming clear? It's an old Blockbuster release. I had to pick this one up because Blockbuster hardly exists anymore. There's only one location, which is in Bend, Oregon. So I had to pick this one up because this could be worth something. Who knows? To a collector. The disc is not in the best condition, but it might play. It's not a 100% not meant but I picked it up anyway because it's it's it might play who knows I'm gonna try it though Badder Santa which is the unrated version of Bad Santa I've seen the original version but I've never seen the extended version the uh, unrated version and of course Kiss Symphony this one's a really good pickup I thought it's really good. I thought it's I'm it's really good. It's I got it for like twenty bucks. It was cycled records and stuff. These I got a good well the ones I sold you previously. I meant to show you that I pick up stuff like at Goodwill, Winco Foods, which is some that I got here. I meant to clarify that in the beginning, so my apologies. And stuff like that. It's really entertaining film. That, um, I seen this. It's on YouTube for free, but I wanted to pick this up because it's worth something. But anyway, and of course, I've got Journey Time box set. Fantastic. So let me show you what's inside real quick. Here's what's inside. And here's the uh, the first disc. The second discs are sorry for the pause. And of course, I really enjoy these films from start to. Fi I really enjoy these CDs. I mean, I love Journey. Journey. Here's the third disc. 
So, yep, it's a really good pickup, I think. And it even comes with a big booklet. Let me show you what it looks like. Really good pickup, I think. Really good booklet. Got that one at, for five bucks at, um, no, not five bucks, 15 bucks at, um, Recycled Records. I don't know why I said five bucks, I mean 15 bucks. And now I've got a CD. We're almost done. Three more items. This is the stuff I never sewn off in my last haul, just to say. I really enjoy this album. It's, um, of course, Boston. Don't look back their second album from this band that came out in 1978. See? And, of course, really good album. And, of course, the two books that I have I'm going to show you off, which is How to Grill. How to Grill, the complete illustrated book of barbecue techniques. Sorry, I had to read it because it's a big title of a book and uh, of course history of Britain see really good book so you a little sneak peek and I'm gonna show you a little sneak peek at this one too yep there's my pickups. That's everything from my thrift storing haul and stuff like that. I don't do thrift videos because I don't know if they'll let me film in the stores is the issue. So, um, if you want to see those, I don't know if I'll do them, though, just because I don't know if they'll let me film in there is the issue. But anyway... Let me know what you thought of what I picked up anyway. I really enjoyed what I picked up. Let me know what you think I picked up and everything. And I'd love to know your thoughts of what I picked up and stuff like that. I really enjoy what I picked up. I love picking up movies and books and CDs and Blu-rays and 4Ks, of course. And sometimes cassettes, not very much. I don't listen to them anymore. I listen to the CDs, and that's pretty much it. But I collect them for collective purposes, not all the time. But anyway, there's my thoughts on this. Thank you for everything you, that you do. Keep subscribing for more content. Instead of lying, then I'll greatly appreciate it. This is Jake Walls and Nerdy Autism, so please stay nerdy. Peace.